Good afternoon. Today we will be demonstrating the control services features of the new Hytera DMR PD782. First, we will identify all the programmable and navigation buttons. Below are the navigation buttons on the front of the radio. Menu, down, up, and back. The programmable buttons are the P1, P2, TK, or the orange button, SK1, and SK2. These keys have dual programmable features. Group call. There are several methods of making a group call. First, from a pre-programmed channel that has been programmed for a specific group, simply press the P PTT button. The second method to make a group call is to press menu key, select contact. Now using the navigation key, scroll to the manual dial, select manual dial, enter the group ID you wish to call, press the pound key to toggle between private or group ID, press push to talk. The third method to make a group call is to press menu, select contact, select contact list, scroll to group ID or alias, then press push to talk. private call. There are several methods of making a private call. First, from a pre-programmed channel that has been programmed for a specific TX contact name, private ID, simply press the push to talk button. Two. The second method to make a private call is to press menu key, select contact. Now using the navigation key, scroll to the manual dial. Select manual dial. Enter the private ID you wish to call. Press the pound key to toggle between private ID or group ID. Press PTT. The third method to make a private call is to press menu, select contact, select contact list, scroll to private ID or alias, then push to push to talk. One touch call. Simply press the pre-programmed button from one of the five available short or long programmable buttons as your one-touch call. The following list is the available calls that can be pre-programmed using the one-touch call feature. Private call, quick text, alert call, radio check, remote monitor, radio enable, or radio disable. At this time, we will demonstrate the quick text feature using the side key one button. Now we're going to view the message. Simply by selecting view, 
The message reads, Welcome to Hytera Control Services Tutorial. You will notice how nice and clear the message looks on the large color four line LCD display without having to scroll. Emergency call. By simply pressing the pre-programmed top key or orange button, you will generate an emergency call. You will briefly see on the screen the message sending alarm and if sent successfully an acknowledgement will be received. The receiving radio displays a group ID and alias if pre-programmed and you will hear an audible alert tone. The telephone icon will appear red Alert call. To make an alert call, press the menu key. Select contact. Select contact list. From the contact list, select ID to whom the alert call is going to be generated. From the option menu, select control services. Select alert call. The receiving radio will display the private ID of the caller with a message alert call with audible alert tone and vibration if pre-programmed. Radio check. To make a radio check, press the menu key. Select contact. Select contact list. From the contact list, select ID to whom the radio check is going to be generated. From the option menu, select control services then select radio check. Your radio will display target radio available only if the receiving radio is within range and the power is turned on. Radio monitor. To enable radio monitor, press the menu key. Select contact. Select contact list. From the contact list, select ID to whom the radio monitor is going to be sent. From the option menu, select control services. Select radio monitor. Your radio will display the alias of the radio that you're monitoring for a pre-programmed time only if the radio is within range. Radio disable. To send a radio disabled command, press the menu key. Select contact. Select contact list. From the contact list, select ID to whom the radio disabled command is going to be sent. From the option menu, select control services. Select radio disabled. At this time, the command has been sent to the receive radio immediately disabling the radio functionality in which the radio will no longer be able to receive or transmit even if the radio is powered down or the battery has been removed. Radio enable. To send a radio enable command, press the menu key. Select contact. Select contact list. From the contact list, select ID to whom the radio enable command is going to be sent. From the option menu, select control services. Select radio enable. At this time, the command has been sent to the receive radio immediately, enabling the radio functionality in which the radio will reboot and return to normal. Text messaging. To send a text message, press the menu key. Scroll to message. Select message. Select quick text. Select one of the pre-programmed messages from the available list to be sent. Press confirm. From the option menu, select send. 
Select a contact list. Scroll to private ID or alias and press select. At this time, the quick text message has been sent to the receive radio immediately for viewing. On the receive radio, select view. The message reads, this concludes the Hytera Control Services tutorial. Please visit our website at www.hytera.us or for more info, email us at marketing at hytera.us. This concludes the tutorial on Hytera DMR Control Services. Thank you.